They found this bulletin in which my great-grandfather, PJ McArdle, he was essentially a union leader, and my great-grandfather wrote this phrase, May it live long and prosper will what? <laughs> So That's insane. 1899. The fact that 115 years later or something, I would get cast as a character who was known for that very phrase, there was something about it that felt bigger than me. You know, there was something about it that felt kind of cosmic. And it was just such a wonderful connection. Mm -hmm. The members here all are well pleased with the journal, and, and well they may be. It is bright and clean and a credit to the AA members at large. I enclose a list of subscribers from the mill. May it live long and prosper. Will what? <laughs> That's crazy. So That's insane. 1899. So to explain that a little bit, that line was a famous line from a, a stage play of Rip Van Winkle. So PJ likely either saw the stage play or even more likely, it was something he heard from his fellow workers. This was as close as you get as a catchphrase. Wow, that is mind blowing to me. But the fact that, I, I, I mean, 112 years before I would get the role of Spock, my great grandfather put that phrase in a letter. What are the chances of that? Amazing. Wow, okay. 